Hi guys and welcome to another kit review. Today we're going to do a very short one. Okay, so this is a mini art kit. Kit number is 36040. It is a mini arts street section with tram lines, part of their diorama series. So in this you get the cobblestone street section plus the uh, tram supports. Okay, so this kit Basically, it's 356 millimeters long and 267 millimeters wide. Okay, so if you've got one of um, Mini Arts trams, this is an ideal accessory to extend your base size. All right, so outside of the box, usual warnings. It's 14 plus, not for children under three. On the ends, same again, just a repeat of the cover. And on the other side, you've got photos of the actual um, street section itself, plus a couple of other. So this is a Mini Arts Bricks pavement and a Cobblestone pavement. All right, so I don't know if these two are still available. Uh, must have a look, see. This one, I believe, is still, but I'll check and I will let you know. Okay, so, as I said, not much to this. Very simple, straightforward street section. Great for a diorama. Right, so, box top out of the way. Instructions. Sprue layout. Warnings. How to construct the tram line supports. And... How to put the street section together that's it so as i said this is uh 356 millimeters long so quite a decent size all right so put that aside and there you go vacuum formed one pack two street sections and the accessories we'll have a look at those Kit number is also on the bag, which is exactly what I like. So we'll put that away. Grab the knife. So this is standard mini art vacuum form. All right. So if you're not sure how to use it, how to make it, etc. Although this is a quite straightforward glue together one. They do have an instruction video. On their website all right so you've got two pieces of street which basically will go together like that nice detail as with all vacuum form you get holes and bumps so bumps and things like this you can just scrape them up the holes is your choice you can fill them or just pretend they're a hole in the actual brick and pavement cracked and damaged so that's something to remember if you're going to go for a a new scene you may want to try and fix up some of this damage tram lines so the tram lines have spots on them as well so they'll have to disappear okay that's those and those and so you get two of these these are your basic okay supports for the actual wires very fine nice detail and no flash so that is going to be an extremely challenging piece to get off if you need it but um, I think in all they will look actually quite impressive and uh, I do have one of their trams the European tram so I will eventually get around to doing a um, kit review on that and then I think we might uh, get to putting this all together okay so that is basically it
be it. Not much to this kit, like I said. Basic instructions, basic diorama base. Okay, so like I said, if you've got one of their trams, this will be ideal. You can use this in any setting. Even if you haven't got one of their trams, then again, put a wall or a building behind here. There you go. Perfect diorama for your tank or vehicle or whatever. Okay, and that brings us to the end of this one. As I said, this is Mini Art Street section with tram lines. Cost me next to nothing, I think. It's about 20 something dollars Australian. And I believe it is still available. Okay, so that brings us to the end of this one. Thanks for watching. Hope you got something from it. And uh, check you later.